I'm Captain... Captain Christopher Pike, USS Enterprise, in temporary command of Discovery. But soon you'll return to your ship. I could say more about your future, but you won't like it. What's been on your mind, Chris? The fight on Rigel 7? Shouldn't it be? My own yeoman and two others dead, seven injured. Was there anything you personally could have done to prevent it? Oh, I should have smelled trouble when I saw the swords in the armor. Chris, you set standards for yourself no one could meet. You treat everyone on board like a human being except yourself. Well, now you're tired and you... You bet I'm tired. I'm tired of being responsible for 203 lives and... I'm tired of deciding which mission is too risky and which isn't and who's going on the landing party and who doesn't. And who lives. And who dies. Missing the war. While the Enterprise was on its five-year mission, it uh, took a toll on my crew. On me, too. Release the plasma from the nacelles. Three bursts, five minutes apart. We need this fuel. That wasn't a suggestion, Mr. Tyler. Captain, every decision you made so far is about your guilt at sitting out the war. You're trying to prove your bravery at the expense of our lives. That's enough! Is there any location on that asteroid that we can beam to? Negative. Cloud of charged particles will disrupt transporter signals. The unpredictable gravity fields will make landing impossible. If there's anybody down there, I'm not leaving them there to die. Starfleet ordered you to stay away for a reason. Enterprise was an instrument of last resort. You're aware we're no longer at war? This last war, sir, took a toll on those who fought it. You set a trap, I go down, you let me start to suffocate. Are you insane? Absolutely not. But we do not see any other way. What you are asking me to allow is in direct opposition to the oath I took as a Starfleet captain. Your call. This thing is going to blow in 90 seconds. There's an emergency lever for the blast door. Seal off the rest of the ship. No. We are out of time. Everyone on the bridge, maybe everyone on this ship will die. And if you do this, you die. This is my ship, my responsibility. This is real. The delusion's ability to project illusions across space is limited. And the farther away you are, the harder it is to sustain. Mike, disengage your transporter beam immediately. I can't do that. If one of us doesn't let go, Burnham and Spock will be ripped apart atom by atom. What do I do, sir? Captain. Let your friends go. It's the only way. Goodbye, Tina. Tell me, Captain. What did the monks ask in return? to play. 